okay, you are here because you want to make more income for yourself and your family and you decided that you want to sell online. Okay, and one of the best platforms for you to sell on it is Lazada, which is one of the top uh, uh, selling platforms in Southeast Asia. So they have it on Singapore, Malaysia, Philippines, Thailand, and Indonesia, and so on. So come. So I'm going to show you this very full detailed step-by-step -step video on how exactly are you going to sell on Lazada, especially Lazada Malaysia. Okay. Number one, you need to get um products. Okay. Think of products to sell. If you're not sure, you can see one of my videos. Okay. Here. Okay. And then step two, you register your account to sign up as a Lazada seller and you list your things there. And step three, you need to do a lot of marketing, not just putting your products there and expecting a lot of sales. So how exactly do we do that? Okay, so uh, for, I'm going to skip the first part, which is the uh, find products to sell, which I already made the video. Okay, and then now we go into the second and third part. So come, let's go. So before I begin, let me introduce myself. I am Kong. I've been selling on Lazada for the past seven years and I am also a Lazada certified trainer. And recently, I won the Lazada Woman of the Year Award and also the Lazada Best Trainer Award for this year. So I have helped so thousands of my students, all of them that have grown their business, okay, to bigger and bigger and bigger, just like me. And for those of you here that are have um some questions or you want help okay to grow your sales i have courses i have trainings for you all you have to do is contact me and click the link below so what you do is you type in this word okay lazada La -La center okay and then you search it on google and then you just click in Okay, so for those who are new, um, they need to press here, create an account. Okay, create an account. Press create an account. So once you are in create an account, okay, there's two things that you need. Okay, one, it is your phone number and then one is your email. So once you are... Uh, you you sign up okay you can uh your, your phone number and email cannot be changed okay unless you want to have another account okay so right now once you sign up and you fill up so the things that you need okay what are the documents that you need to be a lazada seller okay you can be an individual seller you need your just your ic okay or your id okay or you can be a company seller, so you need your uh, SSM or your senior behind all your documents, okay? And you need a bank account. So no matter you are individual seller or a uh, business seller, your name need to match your bank account. So that's why when you sign up later and after the um, Lazada will need you to verify your bit a bank statement you need to upload to, to get a payment okay so uh remember so these are the few things that you need so now uh once you you sign up with your phone number and we will go to the next screen which is uh imagine that you already signed up okay So this is my practice account so right now you go here to the settings and you press settings okay so once you are here you need to go to your profile one this is for new accounts only one time only okay you go to your profile and wait for it to load for a while which the information that i told you is not that you need is your um to upload a bank statement the bank statement need to match your IC or ID, okay, or your SSM. So let's say that your name is uh, Janet and you uploaded the IC Janet, but your bank account, you put your company, which is the uh, curvilicious.com, okay, which is uh, then your account will be, uh, payment will be on home with Lazada. 
Okay, so you need to put in your warehouse address. Okay, and also you need to put in uh, your relevant information that you need to fill in. Okay, so once you are in your profile and you just registered, you need these important things. Fill in this few things here your business information, your bank account, and you need to upload a statement that matches the your name and then your warehouse address and your operation days. Okay, and then you can upload your logo okay, later and then you can determine your shipping provider. But without a warehouse address, they won't give you a shipping provider. Okay, so in Lazada, there you cannot choose your own shipping provider unless you have a very specific reason that uh, you can appeal, but it is auto default to a certain provider. Okay, so now um, that all you have set up this, your logo and everything, then you can start listing your products in the Zara. Okay, so after you've done all this, then we can start listing our products. So to list our products, all you have to do is go to add products. Okay, so make sure you have all your titles, your images all prepared. So you can copy paste your titles and then there's auto category, choose your category. Okay, and then if you have video, you can put in and you put in your brand. Okay, what are the skin? Okay, uh, something like that. Okay. Then all this that the key key all this need to be filled in. Okay, all, all the key key things need to be filled in. Okay, then you add your photo here. Minimum three photos. Okay, so minimum three photos. So you go to your photos there and take your photos. For example, you want this photo and um, this and this. Okay. You can upload more than three, a maximum of eight. Okay, and you can drag it. And then you put in your description, which you already prepared. Okay. And you can add in your photo here if you want. Okay, you need to put one image in the photo. And you put in your weight and the packaging after packaging it. Okay, this is important. Okay, and then you press submit. Oh, so and you forgot the price. Okay, so you need to press submit and then you press the quantity. And seller SKU you anything you want and then you press default. Of course, this one we are not selling it, we just say test. Lah, okay, but if you're selling it, don't do this. And you press submit. So once you press submit, okay, so your product will be live. Sometimes for new uh sellers, okay, it's not immediately live. So for for if you want to check, okay, go to and click, and then your product is live. <laughs> okay. So that's how you start selling. So recommended for new sellers to have at least 10 products in their shop to start selling. And then there's where here is where you process your orders. Okay, this is my test account. Lah. So this is where you process your orders. Okay, so this is where you process your orders here. Okay, we've got order that's to pack, to ship. Okay, to and shipping. And then there is this is where you set all your promotions like vouchers, okay, vouchers, uh, shipping, taxi combo bundles, and all those here that you can set to attract more customers. So not only you need to list, you need to do marketing, to do promotions, to attract new customers to buy from you. So step one is to open account. Step two is to list your item. And step three is to do marketing to promote your product. So that is how exactly you can sell on Lazada Malaysia. So for those who need help 
Okay, don't hesitate to contact me. Link is below. So for you guys who want more tips, please help me by liking and subscribing to this YouTube channel, which I share a lot of tips for you to make more money, okay, for yourself and your family. So that's it. Thank you. Bye-bye.